That's kids foot locker, so I don't know if that's a kids extra large or if that's yeah, open it up and see. Oh shit. Go ahead and get this fucking shit. This shit is good. <laughs> You would have been pissed if they ain't been for me. Day with Courtney, Kavia, and family. Welcome back to my channel. I have some exciting news to tell y'all. We about to have a whole couple's getaway weekend in a couple days and about to get ready for it. I'm excited. This is our first little vacation since the beginning of the year, especially with all this COVID-19 thing going on. I told y'all a couple videos back. Matter of fact, it was on my birthday vlog. And I told y'all, no matter what mine it was, I was celebrating my birthday because that whole quarantine birthday celebration was bull bullshit. So yeah, this is like our celebration. Carlos birthday was in quarantine. My birthday was in quarantine. And then the other couple that's coming with us is Carlos' brother and his girlfriend. This weekend when we leave, it's actually her birthday weekend. So we all celebrate now goddamn birthdays, okay? Today we actually getting ready to leave. So we got a lot to do. Carlos about to go get him some clothes. We need to go to Walmart and get some things, like some body wash and stuff like that. We need to get the kids together. And then I also need to pack. I have not packed yet. And I really feel like I'm gonna leave something because I'm packing. So late. Oh my god. Hopefully that doesn't happen. I'm excited because we're going to Tennessee. Woo! Woo! Y'all know I had told y'all before I wanted to go to the mountains. I've always wanted to go to the mountains. We're finally going to the motherfucking mountains, y'all. Yes. Y'all ain't going no mountains with us this time. Hell no. Uh-uh. We gonna take y'all next time. We gonna take y'all probably some later on this year. Have y'all own fun at enough time. This is our weekend away from y'all ass. But because we're going to the mountains, we're gonna be doing a whole lot of acting. Of a tea. Got this. I had a GoPro. Y'all know for my birthday, Carlos bought me a GoPro Hero 8. And after playing with the GoPro, I realized I didn't like it. So I returned the GoPro to Best Buy. And now I needed a fucking camera. Because if we're gonna be doing ziplining and shit, I'm gonna record this shit for y'all. And five. So what I ended up doing was going on Amazon. Amazon again. Prime is the devil. Went on Amazon to look for another camera and I came across this one. This is a, a coastal brand. I'll drop all the links in the description below in case y'all are looking for a nice action camera for less than $150. I got this camera and it came with two batteries. It came with a waterproof case already and I took a whole lot of time looking at reviews and things like that to make sure that this camera was up to my standards and that I would like it because today is Wednesday. We're leaving Friday at 3 a.m. I don't have time to go find another camera. So I was hoping and praying that this camera actually was up to my standards but me and Carlos both like it. It came with a ton of shit y'all. Much more shit than my GoPro came with. The GoPro only came with the damn GoPro camera for $400. Hell no. The slow camera is the best one, and I'm taking this camera. I'm coming, Carlos. Come on, um, come on. I didn't know he was ready. I'm in here talking to y'all. Nah, I ain't even ready to leave. Let me get my bag. Let me get my phone. So, long story short, that camera is everything, y'all. The footage is pretty. I'm shooting in 4K. Get his phone. I'm shooting in 4K, and it's gonna be pretty as fuck. What the fuck is up with that squeaky shit, man? Come on, man. That's not what he shoe y'all here. <laughs> can't believe it. This is unbelievable. Y'all look at this soul. A lot of this shit is empty. They had 50% off. I think it was for like two weeks. And I was gonna go, but when I saw that line outside, I said, oh hell no. I'm not about to stand in line. That's my whole big thing about in-store shopping is because I don't like to stand in line. So I didn't come to get the discount. But a lot of this stuff is empty. Ooh, look back here, y'all. Oh my God. I thought the store was closing down. Cause why are you looking at them car seats? Ain't nobody having no baby. He going inside his favorite store. Yeah. That's your song? These are so cute, y'all. Yeah. Ain't having no baby for that. Oh my God, where does all these stuff when Kamal was a baby? Kamal pick him out a little outfit. All right, he did a good job. Yeah, that's him. Oh, what is this day and give me nothing? Ma'am, you just get a lot of clothes in the mail and you get shoes. Chill out. You ain't got your stuff. You got a whole, you got way more stuff than him. She don't ever want to let nobody be great. She don't got to be the center of attention. 
he already have his clothes. So now I think I'm gonna get me some shoes. <laughs> She hungry because she see them Chick-fil-A. That's what it is. And I'm trying not to go there. But she pushing me. I'm not. You is. No, I ain't. Yes, you is. You a bad influence on my habit. Can you get out here already? Because I'm hungry. I think I'm going to get my shoes, y'all. I'm a Jordan kind of girl. I like retro. If it ain't retro, I don't want it. Remember these shoes, y'all? Came in the store to get. That thing going to... Carlos, what do you think about these shoes? Oh, my God. I'm trying to ask him something. Those pretty, but you know that's not my style. Let me see. Never have, so style. This is what he picked. And they cute, but the only max I fuck with is vapors. I think the these raw. Oh. These yeah, ugly. Lemon. I tell y'all. Y'all see what I got on right now? These are the type of shoes I like. You don't, um, this shit kind of small, huh? Oh, hell no. Oh, you just hit me. God, God, she hit me. She hit me. I'm here, ugly as fuck. This is not me. This shit look weird. These shit feel weird, Carlos. This is not me. These look weird on my foot. Maybe because of these ugly ass pants I got on. That's kids oh. footlocker, so I don't know if that's a kids extra large or if that's yeah, open it up and see. Oh, shit. What do you mean we in kids footlocker for? <laughs> Cause I wear kids shoes. So we in kids footlocker clothes <laughs> company to get an extra large shirt now, y'all. Listen. <laughs> The extra large and the kids foot locker is not the same extra large that he got on. He about to just grab the full up shirt because it's the extra large. That shit would have been extra fucking small. You don't stand me in the water. <laughs> I had nothing to do with that. <laughs> oh my god, I'd be saving the hell out of you. You would have been pissed if they even for me. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> Carlos, you been wearing that extra, extra small shirt? <laughs> <laughs> all right, man. Let's just leave. Cause you, oh, you don't, you don't talk about the dang shoe that I actually like. You got all your outfits. You ever get no shoe in there? Mm -hmm. so, no so you got all the stuff you need. Um, run into another pants or some other store. Oh, uh, I just been asking because I ain't really been getting. I really never came in here for a specific thing. So if you was ready, then we could have leave. But I didn't know if I was going to get something or not. I don't know them shoes. I wasn't feeling them shoes because it was next to the pants that I got on or what. Let me make that clear. I didn't dress to impress. I actually was dressed to be comfortable. So when I put these clothes on, I just want to be comfortable by 90 fucking degrees outside. But my tits up on my joggers and my Jordan to be comfortable right now. We are in Wally World. I was dropped us off at the front because it's raining and I lost him. Like I went to the restaurant. He came inside the store and I don't know where he is. So now I'm about to call him on the intercom, y'all. He could be so shitting at me. We done lose Carlos and Walmart, y'all. Oh my God. This was a terrible idea. I'm about to call him on the intercom. He do not like attention like that. Like everybody gonna know that that's the Carlos they talking about in the damn intercom, but. Excuse me, is this the place I stand at for um, the call somebody on the intercom? Sure, did you need to pay somebody? Yeah. Oh, um, what do you need to pay? Carlos. Carlos. Yeah, yes, just, just, yeah just say Carlos. <laughs> Did y'all hear that just now? Come on, he goes back out. <laughs> I hope he been paying attention. Looking y'all, looking for him. Is that him right there? <laughs> Carlos, I had to. No, I had to pee. I knew you mad, but ain't nobody know that it was you. So people know when they fucking see you walking out with me now. I don't fucking like that shit. I, I know you don't like it, but I need to find you. What do you want me to do? You should have just stand right there. I had to use the bathroom. You I didn't use the bathroom. Myself? No, and you was not gonna put that on that video either. You want me to be myself? Yes. <laughs> I knew you was gonna be shitting. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Carlos, 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 just listen to me. Come here, come here, come here. Just listen to me. Damn, listen. You think they know that? Carlos. It's a million and one, Carlos. Carlos, so big as fuck. I walk by there with you. I think you were in it. You walk in the office, and we never find each other. I thought you would know I had to use the fucking bathroom. Where we going? 
to get the stuff that I need. Uh, keep walking, guys. Keep walking. Come on, hurry up. Your daddy ready to go home and he already shitting at me. We got to find him again. They're this time, we lost Carlos and come on. They're going to serve you some chips. They probably and they're trying to get extra snacks. Knowing good and well, we're supposed to be eating right as a family. Oh my god. Oh, I see them. Where? Yeah. I, oh, it was a good Oh boy, he's looking for me again. Fuck. Oh, because I'm about to come to the food section by y'all. He lose me. Damn, my fault. And I told him that he should have went to the ice cream in it. No. What? Where he went to the place where you caught his name. You petty. You petty, bro. I wouldn't have cared. I probably wouldn't have been paying attention to it anyway. I'm about to do this check out things. I'll be back once we get back to the house. Now, y'all gonna pack with me. I already pretty much picked all the stuff that I'm gonna put inside my suitcase. What I do know is that it's supposed to be like 80 something degrees. Like high 80s. So I'm packing accordingly to that. And I'm a little nervous about the weather because we are supposed to do a lot of outdoor activities and the weather keep flipping. Like I kept checking the weather and it keep flip flopping like it was saying that it was going to be sunny Friday which is good. And then it said it was going to be sunny Saturday and then raining on Sunday but then it switched and was like raining on Saturday and Sunday. Hopefully that that does not happen because that's going to ruin the hell out of our trip. And we ain't paying money to be sitting in no motherfucking hotel. The whole time. Hopefully this work out. But God always come through. So I know he got us. Like we're gonna make sure that this trip is everything that we wanted and more. I got a lot of stuff to pay. And after Carlos see all the shit that I'm taking, he's gonna be like, what the fuck you got all that shit in there for? We only going for a couple days. This is all the shit that I need. And the fact that I'm vlogging now, so I gotta take more shit. I've never traveled as a vlogger. So I know that I'm gonna be carrying a lot of extra shit, but I don't know how much extra of the shits that I'll be carrying. Does that make sense? Did y'all get why I was going with that? All right, forget it. This is the one that I had on for my birthday vlog, and I'm trying to get in the habit of wearing things more than once because, like, we always buy new stuff for each occasion and event. So I'm trying to. What? Yay, we! Did you just go and get some new stuff, and you got fucking stuff? He the problem. You an instigator, right? <laughs> Stop loving me, girl. All right, what else I need? I feel like I don't have enough shit, Carlos. Let me get my shit together. I gotta figure this out. Hold on. I need to make sure that all my shit match. This will be defeating the purpose of me bringing a whole lot of clothes if it don't match. Where's the rest of my stuff? Oh. Carlos, you took some of my stuff out of here? What clothes are there? You serious? Why would I take some of your shit, bro? I don't know. Cause you probably be like, hell no, she ain't wearing this, yeah. she ain't wearing this, she ain't wearing this. Yeah, sure. <laughs> I need that. Keep my stuff. Tell me, you ain't take nothing. Why don't you tell me what the hell I'm gonna wear? There you sometimes. Let's swim. Put it in the mind. You're pleasant. What is y'all look cute for? Well, we look cute all the time. Why can't I look cute? I get you a Tennessee girl. You the only 10 I see. Ah! Yeah, look. <laughs> hey. Go with that fucking coonie line. Oh. <laughs> and it's down 2020. Mm-hmm. You play too much, y'all. Oh, that's it. Oh, that is it. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Because I still miss a sign. Okay, so why am I bringing all these tops for the best pants? So. Grab a bunch of pants, please. Alright, bim bim bim. Right. Ah! I crazy. I'm gonna go ahead and grab the other shit that I need. Definitely gonna need this. My wig style coming up. I'm gonna need this lawn curler. I'm gonna need my scarf. I need to take this whole shit right here. Nothing bad makeup. Hold on. Y'all know I cannot leave the house without this. This keeps my lace front down. Look at all this shit. Because I have the best daughter in the whole wide world, she has lent me her suitcase, y'all, for my hair products. Alright, y'all. So in bag number one, I have all my hair products and accessories along with my makeup. I'm still packing the suitcase. In this bag that I'm actually gonna have with me 24 seven, I have my camera accessories. The one that I'm using is also gonna be in this bag when it's not in use. 
my extra batteries in here along my battery charger. I have some sanitizer, lotion, lip gloss, all of that. I think that's about it. So I think I'm ready. I have three bags for three days. Look who at my stuff. So I thought I was that I've added some stuff in my suitcase, y'all. So right now, we about to leave the house and take the kids to my mama's house before we leave because we're leaving in a couple hours. So we're packing up the kids. Leah, tell them bye. Bye. Come on, tell them bye. They got See their book you. bags. They See got ya. their games. They got their iPads. Like As y'all can tell, they have food in their book bag too. Mama don't tell us to bring food, but we like to send our kids with food just so that we know that we're not putting so much of a burden on her. And they are both independent so they can fix their own food. You know, they just need adult supervision. That's about it. My food, let's go. All right, y'all, we are. Yeah, mama house. We're about to go. See ya. Bye. 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 I'm gonna miss y'all. Bye. Let me get them a hug too. too. She's gonna give y'all a hug. Uh, bye. She too much. We'll see y'all when we get back. We'll be calling and checking with y'all. Be good. Hear me? Okay. Give your daddy a hug. About to go. She thought it's so hard to say goodbye. I like, what the fuck with those girls? But you already know we've been going so why you tripping? Mm -hmm. I know, baby. I love you. I don't want you to, I don't want to go behind mm -hmm. Look at them. All right, y'all. So I'm about to go ahead and get off the camera because it's like 11 o'clock. Yes, it's 11.13 and I'm about to have to get up in the next couple of hours. I think I have like three or four hours of sleep that I'm going to get. So I'll be back to record in just a few hours and I'm going to have y'all with me. So I'll see y'all next time. Toodles. Bye.